the global president of Motorola, none other than Mr. Sergio Bunia. Hello everyone, welcome to our event. Namaste. It's the first thing I learned, that's my first trip to India. Another curiosity, that guy that you saw doing the first phone call, his name is Martin Cooper. He did the first call 15 years ago, he's now 94 years, very active. Actually, last week we had the pleasure to have him visit our lab in Chicago. A four hour visit, probably more energized than many of our team members. So, I'm delighted to be here today to launch our latest flagship foldable devices the Razor 40 Ultra and the Razor 40, both 100% manufactured in India for India. Thank you all for being here today. Let me take this opportunity to share some global updates about our global business and what we see ahead. So I think uh, if you look to the, our past history, uh, I took over this business four and a half, five years ago. Until then, what our business were running in profit. So the first phase of our journey was to turn this big back to profitability. What we did four years ago. We are now at 12 quarters of profitability, that means four years, and uh, we are now switching a little to hypergrowth. Uh, after investing in the foundations and the bases, coming back to premium and like double down in many markets, I'm going to tell what that means. It's time for us to accelerate the growth of our business. <coughs> well, our business is healthy and growing across the world. In Latin America, we are the number two provider with more than 21% market share. We are now number three in North America. We achieved this position last year. Actually, when you look only to prepaid business, we are number two, only behind Apple. And in post paid, we still have work to do. And in Asia and Europe, what we are growing what we call 25 points in each market. Actually, in India, last year, while the market decreased around 16%, we grew more than 43%. That means what we call 57 points in the market. Those are good numbers, but we are not nearly satisfied with that. Accelerate in a market that was very tough. And that's even before the launch of our foldable devices. Early sales of our foldable devices show that for the first time we are attracting many consumers from highlands. 30% of our early consumers in markets like North America is coming from iOS. And 46% of the search about Razor is coming from iOS devices. We are very proud of that. So now, what that means in terms of what we are doing for the brand? I think, number one, we are bringing the deals, right? We are redesigning our brand identity. We recreate the Hello Moto. We are putting colors, we are expanding partnerships with partners like Panto. We are seeing sometimes more than half of our sales coming from new colors. Color was something dormant in the industry. Uh, with the Razor launch, in some markets we are seeing 40, 50, 60% coming from Magenta Color. That's a partnership of all of the year we have of Panto. Showing users who are looking for different materials, different colors top of in-flight spans. We are growing our B2B ecosystem through the FinShone and the FinShield devices. Our connectivity between PC, tablets and phones are becoming way and way more seamless. And as I mentioned before, not less important, we are winning our edge franchises, the edge and the razor. We invented the first razor as we saw it in 2003. We were first to market two years ago with the new razor. And uh, now we are very happy with the two launches of the Now, when we look to all these strategic pillars, what that means? It means our goal, when we achieve that, is to double our business in the next two years. We want to be a top three brand globally. That's not different of our ambition in Ninja. That means in Ninja, despite the fact we have double year over year, we need to grow 100% this year and four times in the next year. To tell more about, we're going to be on the stage soon. Very excited to be here. 
a great first two days. Looks like I'm here for a week. I have the opportunity to visit part of sales, learn about the culture, and uh, thank you everybody for joining. And uh, thank you, Sergio. Uh, the wonderful business of Dave and Global. I'll quickly take you through what's happening in India. In India, we saw a strong traction to the Mozilla brand last year, and our sellout grew over last year in calendar quarter, quarter Q1 by by 100%. So every quarter we have seen our sellout grow, and we saw calendar quarter Q1 at 100% over last year. In calendar quarter Q1, while the sellout was 2x, we saw a 43% growth to our selling. We all know that the smartphone market declined by 14% in India. In the same time, as I mentioned, Motorola India grew by 43%. In calendar year Q1, we were one of the fastest growing Android brands in India. We are witnessing a sharp uptake of premium devices in the market. Happy to announce that our premium head series doubled year on year. Financial year 23 versus financial year 22, we were doubled there. And more importantly, our 5G sales were eight times of the previous financial year. Let's check uh, that. For what next? Sergio has already announced that we need to be in the top three brands across the world in the next three years. The same mandate quotes for India. And this year our mandate is to again double our sellout, a high double digit or a triple digit premium to market growth. We have four key pivotal pillars to achieve this growth. Number one, make in India. 100% of the Motorola products are made in India. We are proud to announce today that the razor which we are going to launch in India today are also made in India. It is also with great pride I can say that made in India Motorola smartphones are exported to the highly developed United States of America. Second pillar, made for India. The Indian consumer has different needs and we will continue to make products catering to his or her needs. An example of that is the G62, where we understand that the young Indian consumers are very particular about the processor and it's a key decision making, the making for the consumer is the processor. So in India, we launched the G62 with the 695 Qualcomm processor while the rest of the world was a 435C. The third pillar for us, exploit 5G. As the operators rapidly expand the 5G coverage, 5G enabled smartphones will grow rapidly. And today, as we have redefined the mobile industry many, many times, we continue to constantly explore new ways to connect with our consumers on many different levels. By doing that, we are always looking at ways to enhance their experience and their relationship with our brand. So as you saw in the original title, Beyond Devices, let's start by talking about consumers. What do consumers want today? The consumers of today and the consumers of tomorrow want an emotional connection with the products and with the brands. They want to feel like they belong to a brand. You've heard the term, being part of a tribe. They want to be able to trust a brand. And very important, they want to be able to establish a dialogue with a brand. So what I want to do now is to show you some of these strategic partnerships and areas that we are very focused on to do exactly that. Enhance the relationship between our consumers and our brand. One of those areas is our strategic partnership with Phantom. This is a multi-year partnership exclusive to the mobile category. Thanks to this partnership, we will change how we look, how we present, and how we talk about color in this industry. Our designers, Phantom designers, work together to not only understand consumer trends, but also to define a curated palette of colors that is exclusive to Motorola in the mobile industry. 
thanks to this partnership, we are not only becoming a more fashionable and trendy brand, we are also expanding our reach into different consumer segments and we are there in very important moments during the year, like the announcement of the new color of the year. The final result is in front of your eyes, an ultra slim foldable with a super smooth display that's more pocketable and, once again, extremely flexible in the way it can be used. But, once you flip the Motorola Razr 40 Ultra open, you will find a priceless, incredibly vivid 6.9 inch P OLED screen. This phone comes with a very high refresh rate and flagship specifications. As you can see here, we did a lot of work to also minimize the borders of the device in order to maximize your display experience. The Motorola Razr 40 Ultra was built for consumers who are looking for not only design, but also for high-end specs. It runs on the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 mobile platform. This is a premium tier powerhouse that enables 5G connectivity, elite gaming experiences, and professional quality images. And the Pantone 2023 Color of the Year, Vivo Magenta, which is a very modern nod to the iconic pink Razer V3. Viva Magenta is both powerful and empowering. It revels in pure joy. It encourages experimentation. It's an electrifying shade that makes a standout statement. And consumers really, really love this approach in mobile phones. The new Motorola Razr 40 Ultra comes with an ultra-modern, ultra-pocketable, iconic design thanks to the largest external display on any flip phone in the industry. And you can do more like you can't on any other flip phone, thanks to the multiple ways of use that keep up with all consumer needs throughout the entire day. Once you flip it open, you will find infinite contrast, deeper blacks, thanks to the vivid 6.9 inch P OLED display, with an incredibly fast refresh rate that goes up to 165 Hz, giving you an amazing viewing experience. As you saw from my presentation, across our entire premium portfolio of products, we keep exploring new ways to redefine the expectations that consumers have with the smartphone industry. Within the devices that you are going to see today, we are expanding our color options. We are doing that not only on the Razer family, but across our entire portfolio with incredible finishes and premium experiences across the board. I hope you are excited as we are about this new portfolio. Now, it's before I leave the stage, I would like to share our global campaign for the Motorola Razer 40 Ultra. Thank you so much for your time. I hope uh, all of you really are excited with the devices. They're really cool, right? But along with the devices, you actually also need a strong brand. Motorola as a brand has stood for consistent innovation and is trusted by millions of customers worldwide. And our partnership with Pantone that Ruben explained very beautifully has enabled us to bring the most stylish colors and materials on our, start on our smartphones that allow consumers to stand out with the sense of inclusivity and sustainability that we build into the phones so that we can all contribute in a small way to creating a better future together. Now, along with the products, it's always important to also have an amazing brand story. And to our sustained marketing strategy, based upon these key pillars that I just talked about, I'm delighted to share that our Motorola brand metrics are at their highest level in five years. And we've been recognized, as Prashant was alluding to, by leading industry bodies as one of India's best brands.
India's most trusted brand and India's best 5G smartphone brand. All of this put together forms of brand prowess in the Indian market as consumers and media continue to encourage and then propel our growth. Now, Sergio was on stage earlier and like a typical worldwide guy, he has given us some very, very tough targets. I don't know whether you heard the targets, but doubling a business every year is not easy. But to do that, we have to embark on a journey to propel this brand. Now, as we looked at propelling our brand world, we were looking for an ally who really stood for what Motorola stands for. Namely, innovative, trustworthy, stylish, and willing to challenge the status quo. So we were looking for an iconic persona that Indian consumers would be able to relate to and also aspire towards. Someone who's challenged the status quo, someone who's flipped the script and broken through with innovative roles, but is at the same time trustworthy and inclusive through the performances while optimizing glamour and style that you've seen in the products all shown today. And we've come to one name, and it's my pleasure to announce our brand ambassador for Motorola, Fiti Sama. While she did not join us at the event, we do have a message from her. Can we play the message for us? Hello, Moto. I love saying that. <laughs> Hi to you all. I would have actually loved to be there with you guys in person of the launch of the Moto Razor 40 Ultra and the Razor 40. While I've not been able to be there for the event, let me tell you, ever since I've got hold of this new razor, I'm actually been well, flipping well, it well, in well, half. Well. And I'm not really surprised because Motorola has always been a pioneer yeah, and a leader in innovation. And in fact, my first home was actually Motorola. I have personally owned a motor razor for the longest time. So I'm super, super delighted to be a part of this iconic brand. And I really look forward to even more exciting innovations. All the very best guys for the launch. The launch is very fast from the market. You have to think about how fast the market is going to be fast. This is our vision that we are going to be fast. Where we are going to be fast, we are going to be fast. 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 Flipkart is available. Amazon is available. You have seen that Razer product is Amazon. We are going to be fast. 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 सर्विस में हमारे पास आज की डेट में साढ़े तीन सौ से ऊपर टच पॉइंट्स हैं कंज्यूमर टच पॉइंट्स हैं जहाँ पे वो हमारी सर्विस करा सकते हैं अक्रॉस इंडिया और उसके साथ साथ हमारे वेरियस अदर सोल्यूशन हैं हमारे डेडिकेटेड कॉल सेंटर हैं हमारे चैटबॉट्स हैं जिसके जरिए वो किसी भी समय हमारे कस्टमर सर्विस को रीच कर सकते हैं इवन सोशल मीडिया पर भी वो हमारे कस्टमर सर्विस को रीच कर सकते हैं तो सर्विस को लेकर हमने पूरी यू नो कोई कमी नहीं छोड़ी है और हमने इनफैक्ट रेजर के कस्टमर्स को तो एलिट केयर दिया है जो कि फोन में काफी ज़्यादा दिक्कतें आती हैं जो फोल्डेबल फोन होते हैं स्क्रीन प्रोटेक्शन को लेकर किस तरीके को प्रोटेक्शन दी गई है देखिए इसमें अगर आप देखेंगे जैसा कि प्रेजेंटेशन में भी आज बताया गया था ये फोन जो है ये इसमें स्क्रीन में बहुत जबरदस्त प्रोटेक्शन दिया गया है गोरिल्ला ग्लास विक्टस करके जो तो प्रोटेक्शन आता है ये हाइएस्ट वन ऑफ दाइएस्ट रेट का प्रोटेक्शन है जो बाहर के स्क्रीन पर भी दिया गया है और अंदर के स्क्रीन पर भी दिया गया है और इसके दोनों डिस्प्ले ग्लास में बेस्ट है आउटसाइड डिस्प्ले एक सौ चौवालीस हर्ट्स के रिफ्रेश रेट के साथ आता है और इनसाइड डिस्प्ले एक सौ पैंसठ हर्ट्स के रिफ्रेश रेट से ज़्यादा आता है जो कि आपको किसी भी फोन में देखने को नहीं मिलेगा और जहाँ तक प्रोटेक्शन की बात जैसे आपने कही तो बुरिल्ला ग्लास विकनेस का प्रोटेक्शन है जो कि गिरने पर भी नहीं टूटेगा और साथ में अगर हमने आप बॉक्स की बात करें बॉक्स कॉन्टेक्ट्स की बात करें तो हमने बॉक्स में ही एक हार्ड केस कवर भी दिया हुआ है इसका कि आप जब खरीदें तो उसमें कवर भी लगा सकते हैं